This week's ministry update from Capital Ministries and President and Founder Ralph Drawlinger is about Capital Ministries launching a ministry to Mexico's new Congress. After months of preparation and shortly after many evangelicals were voted into national office, Capital Ministries launched a new ministry to members of the Bicameral National Congress of the Nation of Mexico this week. The October 12th launch was held at the Bankers Club, which has been called the most beautiful auditorium in Mexico City. The group was welcomed by CM ministry leader Ricardo Arizmendi, a nationally recognized Bible teacher and evangelist who has worked in key positions with several highly regarded international ministries. Ralph and Danielle Drawlinger, founders of Capital Ministries, who represented the White House cabinet member Bible study and... Oscar Zamora of Peru, Capital Ministries Latin America Global Director, who orchestrated the ministry launch. The new Congress will be sworn in on December 1st, and the weekly Bible studies will begin in January of 2019. Said Zamora, quote, After visiting Mexico, I saw firsthand the open doors that God has allowed for His Word to be taken to the Asamblea Nacional, the Congress of Mexico, end quote. Zamora is one of seven Capital Ministries global directors who are charged with creating sustainable ministries to national political leaders in their respective geographic sphere of the world. A new political climate that has seen an unprecedented number of evangelicals elected to office help make the ministry planting possible. On July 1st, the people of Mexico elected as their president former Mexico City Mayor Andres Manuel Lopez Obrador, who ran on an anti-corruption and an anti-crime platform. A large number of his supporters, including many from the Evangelical Political Party, PES, were elected to Congress and now make up the majority. Zamora said, quote, As never before, members of the Evangelical Political Party were elected. Shortly after the elections, I had the pleasure of meeting with an elected member of the House in Mexico City, and he was eager to start a Capital Ministries Bible study, support Ricardo Arizmendi, our ministry leader, and connect him with other legislators. We are really excited about what is coming for Mexico, end quote. Capital Ministries has divided the world into 10 sections, and Zamora is one of seven global directors that CM has appointed to lead expansion in their area of the world. Global directors are charged with finding and working with godly Bible-teaching evangelists and Christian parliamentarians to create sustainable ministries inside Capitol buildings for political leaders. Arismendi believes the weekly Bible study, where God's Word is regularly taught, will fortify Mexico's leaders, help them mature in their faith, and guide them as they legislate in keeping with God's precepts. Arismendi shared, quote, We believe that a nation influenced by God's principles through His Word is what our country needs desperately, end quote. Arismendi successfully completed the Capital Ministry's annual fall training that was held at the Museum of the Bible in Washington, D.C. last year. After accepting the global director position in early 2017, Zamora has led the planting of ministries in Uruguay and Ecuador. Additional ministry launches are scheduled this fall in Honduras and Brazil. Most recently, Zamora and Elizabeth, his wife and ministry partner, had a very successful trip to Costa Rica last week to discuss creating a ministry to that nation's political leaders. As a result, plans are now underway to launch a capital ministry there, too. Under Zamora's leadership, a number of capital ministries Bible studies, in addition to those already offered on the CM website, have been translated into Spanish. Zamora also arranged for Drawlinger's book, Rebuilding America, the Biblical Blueprint, to be translated into Spanish under the new title, Reconstruyendo una nación, rebuilding a nation. Zamora has often said that Latin American nations are ripe for discipleship Bible studies to their leaders, and Capital Ministries' recent growth in that area of the world is proving him correct, 
says Ralph Drawlinger, president of Capital Ministries. Quote, the Holy Spirit is really moving and opening tremendous doors for the gospel in these countries. Not only do ministries and federal capitals edify and build individual public servants in Christ, but they are symbolic as to the direction a country is headed in. We have been praying and thinking about launching a ministry to Mexico's leaders for many years. Having grown up in San Diego, I developed an affinity, love, and respect for my Spanish-speaking neighbors during my childhood years as we often traveled and today continue to travel south of the border. This ministry launch is not only a dream come true, but a prayer come true. The time is right, end quote. If you wish to support Capital Ministries' international ministry plantings, go to capmin.org.